Hello, I am Dr. Anirudh from Toothpicks Dental Healthcare, Jayanagar, Bangalore. There is definitely a relation between dental age, bone age and chronological age. Chronological age is generally uh, after birth, since the day of birth we assess the chronological age. Whereas the dental age of the patient is dependent on the eruption of the teeth inside the oral cavity. A child can first have uh, teeth inside the mouth at the age of uh, six months or you know the tooth may erupt after one year or for some patients uh, we have seen that it erupts only after the age of two. The first dentition comes inside the mouth at the age of two. So generally there is a difference, uh, that there is a discrepancy. It is very important for a pediatric dentist or a pediatrician to know the bone age as well as the dental age as well as the chronological age to assess the growth. Because bone uh, development, the age of the bone is also very important for the growth in the body. So it, it, can, uh, it can signify a certain changes in the body uh, or a certain deficiency or if there is any nutritional deficiency in the body. A lot of other things can be assessed with bone age as well as uh, uh, chronological age. The comparison basically uh, is very important. So therefore, uh, uh, using different diagnostic methods, uh, we can assess uh, bone age as well as uh, dental age. These correlations are extremely important to treat a patient, not just with respect to uh, dental treatment, it is also important to uh, treat the patient in other aspects, to understand the nutrition, to understand the kind of uh, systemic health the patient has. So it becomes very important to understand all the three, uh, dental age, bone age and chronological age.